In this tutorial, I'm going to show you two ways to insert a background image to a Word document. If you find this content useful, then I'd really appreciate it if you let me know by leaving a like on the video. And with that intro out of the way, let's get to it. I've got a new Microsoft Word document open here, which as you can see is plain. Now to insert a background image to a Word document, there are generally two ways to go about this that I know of anyway. For the first method, you go to the design ribbon at the top. Then go to the area that says page background. Then click on page color. From here you can actually select a solid color to change the background color. But for this example, I will select the last option called fill effects since I want to insert an image rather than a solid color. From here, you can select to have a gradient, texture or pattern as the background. But for me, I want to select the picture tab. Then click on the select picture button. There are three options. The first will let you choose a picture saved on your computer. The second will let you choose a picture from the internet via a Bing search. And the last option will let you choose a picture saved on your OneDrive. I will select the first option. Then I will find the picture saved on my computer that I want to use. And then I'll click the insert button. Finally, click the OK button to add this to your document. Depending on the size of your image, it may be repeated multiple times in the background. So that's the first way of adding a background image to Word. I'll quickly change the background back to a plain white background before I show you the next method. Another way you can add a background image to a Word document is to actually create a watermark. To do this, go to Design, Watermark, then select Custom Watermark. Select the second option to add a picture watermark. Then click the select picture button. Again, I will select to choose a picture from a file. And I will click on the image and press insert. I will also untick the washout box for now and just click apply to show you what this looks like. As you can see, the image has been added as a watermark. You can then adjust the scale settings if you want the picture to cover more of the document. I'll change mine to 50% and click apply. Now the image fills the full page. Finally, by selecting the washout option, this will fade the image slightly. Here's what my example looks like with the washout added. This is useful if you want to show a faint background image on your document rather than having the standard image. I'll click the close button since I'm happy with these settings. And there you have it. Now you know how to insert a background image to a Word document. If you found this video useful, please leave a like. It really does help support the channel. If you've got a question, pop it down in the comments below. Also, consider subscribing for more weekly tutorials.